in case of expansive soil that means uh, we use this to call in india black cotton soil the most sought after foundation is uh, i can tell you once again pile foundation pile foundation is the choice in case of expansive soil but uh, the fact is uh, whatever the bulb we are providing additional bulbs the bulb should be below the active zone this is active zone so this bulb should be uh, provide below the active zone the first bulb you have two bulbs actually in many case double under reamed double under reamed you can write it actually under reamed pile foundation is recommended many times in vijayawada uh, we are recommending double under reamed pile foundation and also first bulb is below 1.7 meter below ground level so this is what the common recommendation many times we are uh, suggesting in soil reports uh, regarding selection of foundation in this expansive soil but expansive soil uh, also called swelling soil uh, this black cotton soil uh, actually the name why the name has came uh, this soils uh, what i say uh, is boon to farmer actually whenever a farmer come across black cotton soil he will be very happy the reason you see uh, cotton is a white gold where cotton will grow and also the color is black that's why we tempted to speak expansive soil as black cotton soil in india in india but uh, the right name is expansive soil the problem why it is swelling because of monty mortar right it exhibits swelling in a monsoon and it exhibits in case in uh, what is a summer so because of seasonal moisture changes what happen in in monsoon in rainy season uh, this water what is say enter into the soil then soil absorb the water and it will swells it will swells because our black cotton soil is cation storm it's uh, this montemorillite having negative charge on its surface it will absorb water immediately once it's absorbing water its volume will increases that's why because of the swelling so there is a lot of damage to lightly loaded structure like roads and g structures and g plus 1 structures are badly damaged due to seasonal moisture changes one cycle is completed one cycle means one swelling shrinkage in the next year again swelling shrinkage swelling shrinkage swelling shrinkage uh, after 12 cycles you just imagine the uh, distress caused by the is expansive soil and foundation and all together to the structure especially light structure that's why we recommend this additional anchor additional bulb so which acts as an anchor actually which acts if you soil trying to swell these bulbs are trying to what i say provide as an anchor provide as an anchor so then if soil trying to swell these anchors are not allowing to swell so that's why in india uh, this is the invention happened in india the under reamed pile foundations are developed by cbri cbri roorkee Uh, we have a central building research institute in roorkee uh, many inventions uh, happened in uh, many inventions in civil engineering started at roorkee even our first engineering college is university college of engineering roorkee now it is iit roorkee so anyhow many things are uh, supposed to happen in roorkee uh, now cbri you know central building research institute they developed this uh, what is under reamed pile foundation they drafted one code also is 2911 part 3 uh, this is what i say this is the compendium uh, encyclopedia of uh, under reamed pile design many engineers uh, civil engineers throughout india uh, are uh, uh, depend on this code book is 2911 part 3 uh, to categorize to identify expansive soil also uh, they have written a wonderful uh, guidelines the uh, what i say differential free swell index from that you can identify whether a soil is expansive or not after identification of expansive soil uh, many times we recommend uh, under reamed pile foundation 
someone can ask me sir uh, is there any difference between pile and under rim there is no much difference actually see uh, yeah, as usual it is a pile it is a pile but the only thing we are providing additional bulbs additional bulbs i can tell you the bulb diameter bulb diameter is 2.5 times d uh, 2.5 times d so this is the 